Okay guys, it is week 14 as of Thursday and I didn't have anything really to update you guys on. Everything's been going pretty well. Um, I'm going home to South Carolina in a couple weeks to interview a couple um, new wives and, well not a couple, as of right now, hopefully, when she gets back to me, she let me know if the dates are okay for her. Um, I found a midwife that I really like. And we've emailed back and forth a couple times, and I really need a good vibe from her. So I'm hoping um, she'll be the one to call. I really like her, but, you know, we'll see when we get home. Um, and there's this jula that I saw online, and I... Um, I don't know how you would get a good vibe from someone's website. I don't know. But I kind of just get this feeling like she is going to be the person for me. So I have to contact her and see if she's available to meet when I'm home and see if I can nail down a labor team for me because I have officially decided that I will be doing the home birth, um, water birth. Now, it is just making sure the finances are in order to cover everything because there's a possibility that my insurance will not, um, well, they won't cover it straightforward, so I would have to pay for it and then be reimbursed for it um, after everything's already done. So either way, I'd have to come up with the money for it, so whatever, it doesn't really matter. Um, yeah. But I didn't have anything really to say about the pregnancy. I have a doctor's appointment on the 4th, and I'll let you guys know how that is. And then I find out the sex of the baby the Saturday following that on the 13th. So, ooh, crazy excited. Trying to hold out today. But I got a package in the mail yesterday that I ordered from this company called um, Lost River Naturals in Charleston, South Carolina, and um, I actually found this website from the website of the midwife that I'm interested in using for my home birth, so I got her package in the up today, and I'll open that now as we can open, open it with you guys, because it's kind of exciting. Let me take off my name. I don't want to rip it. I hope it doesn't come up. Um, I'm sure you guys. I think it's the cutest stinking thing ever. Let me see if I'll burn it. Won't be a stalking lady. So this is what she sent it on. Isn't it? That's not my hand, don't do it. No. Look at the paper. Even this is just the cutest thing, you know? So I just got it in the mail today. Um, just now. And I'm opening it. And I don't want to rip it up, but I'm sure I'm going to order some stuff from her again. So it's not like I want to do it again. So open, open, open. Oh, I'm going to need scissors. It's a box. Um, so I ordered, I think, three things from her website. And it's all um, things she makes out of her own home. And I'm pretty sure her website says she is a natural, not a natural a massage therapist too, so when I go home, I'm thinking about using her as my massage therapist when I go home. Oh, look at that! Okay, oh, on the box it says, um, oh, yay! I'm so excited! It says, thanks, Latoya. I look forward to meeting you when you move to the area. Smile with me, Connie, to know! So I'm going to send this video to you so you can see. Um, so I got a magnet. Oh, you just think I'm going to keep this on my fridge. So I hope you guys can see. Look at that. Isn't that cute? Oh, and everything she makes, she does it herself. I'm pretty sure she said both her and her husband are massage. Yep, they're massage therapists. And I got a little caught. This is just the cutest thing. Ah, oh, so I got this little, like, postcard. Isn't that beautiful? That's the front. And then here's the back. I don't know what we'll see, but I'm trying to like, get in this box. Um, so it just has this, this making this home because it's 
everything's covered in posting courier newspaper, which I haven't seen in like, oh, well, since the last time I went home, which was only a couple weeks ago, but I'm probably going to even look at the newspaper part because I just miss being at home. So pretty much. Okay, so here's the first thing. I love opening packages. So look at this cute ribbon. Ah, uh, or is it not ribbon? Yarn. I wonder if it's wool because it's beautiful. I love it. And it has little. Oh, I'm so excited! And I can't remember exactly what I ordered by name. So, oh my goodness! Oh, I can't wait to smell it. So the first thing I got was a lemon coffee seed sugar scrub, and I haven't gotten ready for the day, so I'm going to be using all this stuff when I get ready after this video. Um, and everything is all natural. Everything in here in the ingredients list I can pronounce. So that's very important to me. Oh my goodness! And it, ah, uh, I can't remember what size it is. Let me look. Um, and she does have a sale going on, uh, right now on her website for some of the cheese and stuff that she has. If I can find the thing, I'm like, here we go. The link. Um, yeah. So let's see, lemon poppy seed. Oh, this is a four ounce jar and it costs ten dollars. And her website, I'll put at the bottom, um, it's just beautiful. Everything about it is beautiful. It's all, like, just labeled, like, you can tell someone took the time and care to put into it. I love the lemon smell on her feet. I like this one. Because I'm making it so cute lately. Oh my god, this is perfect. This smells so I don't want to tilt it because it's like um liquidish sort of this is scrub and but you can see the poppy seeds on the lid. Oh my god. It smells like to me this is the perfect woman set. It kinda smells like um the fresh sugar lip treatment. That's what it smells like and I love that smell. I love that smell. But that shit sucks when you put it on. If you got a summer to get on that a couple months back. So this, I'm going to use this in a little bit and I'm so excited. Then I got more ribbon and tissue paper. I think that I know what this is. I think I know. I think I know. I think I know. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, sorry. This is the, um, the Gentle Healing Cell, and I got, and it says that it's for, like, stretch marks and stuff like that, and I'm getting more from this pregnancy, so I'm going to use it. And, oh, and it's also, it says apply, but I said that it's made with vegan oils infused with organic herbs, calendula, lavender, rose, comfrey, chamomile, and beeswax. And it says apply a small amount to dry or irritated skin from face to toe, eczema, dapper rash, minor burns, etc. And on her website it was saying about stretch marks too. So it's open it up. It's so cute. It's in one of those um, blue glass jars. Um definitely have a smell. Which isn't a bad thing because, you know, if you're putting on your body spray or lotion or whatever, that has a smell. You don't want everything you put on to have a smell. That's gonna clash. But maybe it will when I put it on. But I'm excited to use this too. And there's another label, little label, gentle healing salve. Awesome. Oh, the paper came off. I'll have to put it back on there. So I have that. And the last thing that I got was... Oh, oh, oh. Okay, let's call. Was... Ta -da -da. I need to make an appointment for her when I go home, actually, for the was the, and it's on sale right now, so get it if you can. I'm going to have a couple seconds. The, um, oh, where is it? I believe it's called, oh, the Sage Mama Pregnancy Tea. I'm just going to open up. It's in, like, a Mason-ish type jar. 
good. I'm going to make some of this today for myself. Oh my god. I'm 100% organic raspberry leaf, netto, oat straw, alfalfa, rose hip, peppermint, chamomile, slippery elm. I'm excited to use this. So if you get a chance to get on her website, please do. I haven't, I'm going to definitely, oh, drop the top, review the stuff. Um, once I use them all and let you guys know, but I'm sure they're excellent. So check out her website.